Sup everyone, it's that time again. Let's get mildly suggestive. Let's see what you sickos want from me this time. Truth, does size matter? Yeah, it does. It really does. Big bag. That's right. Dare, try to fit in the fridge. <laughs> mm, well, I don't think I'm getting into that. I don't think this is working, pal. <laughs> I'll approach this from a different angle. I don't think it's gonna work. Oh, that doesn't sound good. <laughs> Well, that was a giant fail. Truth. Have you ever been raped? <laughs> Dare. Show your tan line. Oh my god, I'm like a gold panda. Dare. Attempt the splits. Let's do this. Yep, that's as much as these jeans will give. Truth. What's your most embarrassing vomit-related story? Well, it all happened a long, long time ago. Well, not really, I was 16. Anyway, I was working at my weekend job at Focus, which is a DIY shop, and basically I was having one of those days where you're feeling really, really ill, and you're feeling so ill that you feel like you're going to be sick at any moment, so you don't want to move, you don't want to speak, and you don't want to do anything, basically. And there I was, walking around, watering some plants, when all of a sudden I felt Oh god, I'm gonna throw up right now, I need to get to the toilet. Which is exactly when an old lady came up behind me and said, Oh, hello young gentleman, can you help me move a shed? And I was just like, Oh my god, I am gonna be sick right now. If I don't find somewhere to be sick, I am literally gonna projectile vomit hydro pump into this old lady's face, which is not something I wanted to do, so I said to her, I'll just be one second, and I ran around the corner like, Oh god, oh god, I'm gonna be sick, and... Then I saw an expensive looking plant pot and uh bleh. So uh yeah, I hope nobody bought that plant pot. Dare scare Phil. Phil What? I can't get it to work. I'm in the bathroom. <laughs> I hate you! Dare, call someone in the phone book and ask if they'd like a bedtime story. Hello? <laughs> Why is no one here? Hello? Hello? Would you like to hear a story? Please? Please let me tell a story. <laughs> Dare, try to smoke a pocky. Stinks. <laughs> Truth. Is it true you have a picture of Charlie McDonald on your pillow? Oh no, you guys caught me out. How embarrassing. Fuck, I thought it was the other pillow. Fucking hell. Dare. Spike your hair with shaving cream. This is gonna be disgusting. Mmm, <laughs> time to get my Jedward Smurf on. Oh, uh, I look like Paul from Tekken. Paulie D from the Jersey Shore. <laughs> Malfoy. Right, well, I'm gonna get in the shower because that's absolutely disgusting. Dare. Do Mentos and Coke. Under your shirt. <laughs> okay, so I may or may not need this protective screen depending on how much of a fail this is about to be. <laughs> My nipples got foamed on. <laughs> Well thanks guys, that was fun and horrific at the same time. The things I do. Dare, do the sexiest dance you can do without getting flagged. <laughs> <laughs>